Hi, my name is Christy DeHaunt, and today we're going to be doing a grocery tour of Wegmans in Rochester, New York. Here we have some beautiful local strawberries, which are rich in antioxidants, vitamin C, and potassium. I couldn't leave out these beautiful local sunflowers. Apples are rich in vitamin A and fiber. Here we have some freshly prepared fruit, which is great if you're trying to save time. Red bell peppers are rich in vitamin C, and yellow and orange bell peppers are rich in vitamin A, also known as beta carotene. Here we have some beautiful fresh and local produce. If you've never tried New York sweet corn, you have to try it. Here we have some freshly prepared pizzas if you're trying to save time. There's also some really nice fresh juices here. Here we have a wide variety of tomatoes, which are rich in folate, vitamin C, and potassium. While it's always best to shop locally and in season if you can, they also have a wide variety of tropical and exotic fruits. We have some lush, fresh hydroponic basil here, which is great for adding flavor to all kinds of dishes. Broccoli is rich in vitamin C and calcium. Sweet potatoes are rich in vitamin A, fiber, and potassium. Bananas are also rich in potassium and magnesium. And Wagman's never fails to impress when it comes to prepared foods. We've got plenty of prepared salads here if you're trying to save time. Also a variety of all different kinds of greens. I most frequently buy spinach because it's versatile. You can eat it raw, saute it, or add it to smoothies. And we have some more seasonal, local produce here, all different kinds of squash. The cheese and dairy section in Wegmans is absolutely massive. It just goes on and on and continues to about three different sections of the store. We have all different kinds of fancy cheeses here, Parmesan, goat cheese, shredded cheeses which are good if you're trying to save time, but if you want a nice melty cheese, it's better to shred it yourself. And Wegmans has just about every single kind of hummus that you could ever imagine. They have a whole section of every kind of hummus possible. My favorite is roasted garlic. Olives are a great source of vitamin E, iron, and calcium. We have a wide variety of all different kinds of meat and protein options here, going from beef to pork to poultry. And lean meats are considered chicken, turkey, pork tenderloin, as well as fish and seafood. We have a wide variety of all different kinds of seafood here, which is the primary source of omega-3 fatty acids. I said it once and I'll say it again, Wegmans never fails to impress when it comes to prepared food. They have so many options, it's sometimes a bit overwhelming. They have freshly prepared sushi made to order, you can get fresh pizza made to order. There's a deli and sub shop and they have a whole cafe as well. Rochester, New York is only about one hour from Buffalo, New York, so we don't mess around when it comes to our buffalo chicken wings here. As you can see, the prepared food section just does not stop. It just goes on and on. These are all the different kinds of soup that they had today. They also have refrigerated, freshly prepared soups that last a little bit longer as well. Here's a variety of freshly prepared sandwiches, which are a great option if you have a quick lunch break and are just trying to get something grab and go. And the dessert and bakery section in Wegmans is absolutely gorgeous. I just love to visually enjoy it because I can't eat any of this food since I'm gluten free. This is the Wegmans Cafe where you can get made to order coffee and lattes. Absolutely love it. Here we have the Old Fashioned Submarine Shop, which is absolutely delicious. It's a staple of Wegmans. Sometimes you can't leave without taking home a plant friend. Here we have every single kind and brand of yogurt that you could ever imagine. Their yogurt and dairy section is absolutely massive, like I mentioned with the cheese section. Here's one section of the grocery store that I visit most frequently, being someone who's gluten-free. They have all different kinds of pasta options for me. 
I like the protein packed chickpea ones as well as the brown rice and quinoa pasta ones. There's also one with spinach that I really like. The Barilla is a good um, corn flour brand. And they have all different kinds of gluten free pizza and frozen products as well. I normally buy the gluten-free frozen bread because I can keep it in the freezer, defrost it, and eat it as I need. And I love this whole grain, seven grain gluten-free bread. They have a wide selection of vegan and plant-based protein in this section as well. They have a wide selection of vegan and plant-based milk, which are normally fortified with calcium and vitamin D. We've got some great flavors of gluten-free pretzels here. They have really nice probiotic gut health drinks, all different kinds of kombucha and kombucha seltzer. Here we have the frozen vegetable section. Frozen vegetables are great if you're trying to save time on prep and especially if you're someone who doesn't use produce fast enough and you end up throwing it away because it goes bad. So this will save you time and money. They often harvest frozen and canned vegetables when they're in season. So that's great as well. I love all the plant-based and vegan options that Wegmans has. These veggie burgers are so good. Here we have some more plant-based milk options. I always go for the oat milk. That's my favorite plant milk. And buy the Wegmans brand since it's the least expensive. It's fortified with calcium, vitamin D, A, and B vitamins. Orange juice is a great source of vitamin C and is fortified with calcium and vitamin D. We've got some local Young Lion beer and Halloween decorations. Wegmans always goes all out for all of the holidays. Here we have all the kinds of seltzer water, which I feel like has gotten much more popular within the last few years. I love the polar water personally. I go for the blueberry lemon, the strawberry watermelon in the summertime, and then the cranberry lime. I love seltzer water because it's so refreshing and it's a great carbonated beverage that doesn't have any added sugar like soda. Here we have all different kinds of salty, crunchy snacks, all different kinds of chips which of course you want to try to eat in moderation, but who doesn't enjoy a nice snack and some chips? We have the canned goods and pantry section, which is great for stocking up your pantries and cabinets. The one thing is you want to look out for the sodium content in these pantry goods. Of course, I have to show you my favorite kind of coffee here. I buy it religiously, and my favorite way to make it is French press. We've got more pantry goods here, pastas, sauces. Again, you just want to sometimes look out at the sodium content in the sauces. Here we have a variety of all different kinds of olive oil, which are a great source of monounsaturated fats and contain oleic acid, which is an anti-inflammatory. Here we have the baking section, which you've got all different kinds of flour, chocolates, and cake mixes, whatever you can imagine. Here we have the cereal section, which mostly contains whole grains. The biggest thing to look out for when it comes to cereal is a lot of added dyes, sugars, and processed ingredients. We have some breakfast and protein bars here, which are a great snack, especially when you're on the go. Here we have a variety of different kinds of nut butters, ranging from peanut butters to almond butters, which are especially a great option for vegans and vegetarians, and they're a great source of protein, fiber, healthy fat, and vitamin E. This powdered almond butter I wanted to point out because it's a great option for smoothies and shakes. And we have all the makings for a great peanut butter and jelly sandwich here. Here's my favorite kind of ice cream here, mint chocolate chip. However, I'm now lactose intolerant, so I gravitate towards the vegan and plant-based ice creams, which are shown here. There's plenty of great vegan and plant-based options for ice cream now. This is their whole selection.
Since I love oat milk so much, I recently tried the Oatly brand of oat milk ice cream, and it's now my favorite kind of ice cream. I have a relatively small grocery haul here because I had already gone shopping earlier in the week. Here's my favorite kombucha as well. I snacked on a Luna protein bar on my way out. And thank you so much for watching my Wegmans grocery tour.